This is a massacre. Another coffin coming in. Two more. Another coffin coming in. So it seems like this is now 10 people. Oh, another one coming in. Another one coming in. They're coming with coffins. Coming in more coffins. People who were killed yesterday. So, we are in the community center now. ¿Ustedes saben cuánto total? ¿Cuánto han, ¿Cuántos muertos total? Total, ahorita 28 muertos, total. Ahora hay que recoger del hospital holandés. So now we've heard 10 people have been killed, but people here don't believe it. They think it's more. Um, there are more. We are in the community center where the doctors are doing the autopsies. People shot in the head, people shot in the back. They're bringing in more coffins for the dead. These are the family members making room right now. The government said last night that three people had been killed, but it was their fault because they were using dynamite. We were here all day yesterday. Now they're yelling, I miss Assassina. And yes, is the name of the self-proclaimed president who made a decree saying that the military and the police would not be held responsible for the acts they committed. And that gave them the green light to massacre people in Sakaba and also to uh, kill people yesterday. Coffins. Okay. Bringing in more coffins. Pasito, <laughs> baby. You, the whole way into this community there's also saying Murillo Asesino he is the equivalent of what would be a chief of staff in our country a minister of government and they're blaming him for this murder of course they're blaming all of the people in this new government, this fascist right-wing government that has unleashed the military and the police to be against the people. And people are so angry. That's why it's screaming. All right, so I'm going to sign off now and come back on when they let us inside. I tell you something. I know. Just one second.